Hello everyone, my, my name is Teal Resferian, and I am going to be showing off my house in Final Fantasy XIV. Uh, first of all, this is my character, Al um, Olive Minna. Uh, I am on the Primal server, uh, and my homeworld is Famfret. Uh, I recently got the White Mage Relic Weapon. Uh, at the moment, White Mage is my main. Uh, I'll probably be changing to, like, Sage uh, when Endwalkers come out. Uh, but that's for that on my character. Uh, my house is in the Mists. It is the 32nd plot in Ward 23. It's a large size one. Um, and I got it when, uh, the last patch that added more house, more housing wards, uh, I got it at, like, 2 or 3 a.m. and was super lucky enough to actually get into the game and, uh, snag this house. Um, the name, I, I named it Olive Garden for, uh, on my previous smaller house, just as like a throwaway gag name. But once I got a large size house and uh, more space, I decided to like make an actual restaurant out of it. Uh, and that's what the ground floor is. Um, that's that on that. Um, we'll just show off the grounds first. Uh, I have it as an otter, otter house. Um, but we walk in and we have this little walking path, a topiary chocobo, uh, my little Moogle mailbox. Uh, I have the little uh, tea set, um, what do you call it, patio, uh, along with some of the purple uh, Norvrant grass. Uh, I have this little Bismarck fountain set up. A little Sephiroth tree. Back here is my teleport crystal. Um, over here is more like a barbecue space with one of my retainers dressed up in the summer wear. Uh, and the monster hunter meat. The little pool and the treehouse. Um, I do not like the heaven on high being here, but I allow it to be here because it lets me get up onto the roof. So we will go up here like this. Uh, here's the little balcony, but from here we can go oops, down a little, uh, like here, so up here, there. No, that usually works. There we go. And then we're all the way on the roof. Uh. I know the, like, forge walls that my neighbors have of way over there, You there's actually, like, a glitch where you can bug through that one staircase over there and get up. Um, but it doesn't really f uh, fit my theme of the inside being a restaurant, which is the only reason why I'm not getting it. Uh, but for now, we'll go inside. Uh, yes, enter it. But, uh, loading. Alright. I have a couple songs playing through loot, but this is the Final Fantasy XV song. Uh, we have the door, we have a coat rack. Um, over here, uh, like I said, the ground floor is the restaurant. This is, like, the, like, party corner. There's the toy box and some wine. There's, uh, the, a piano for the ambiance. Um, this one is a state man servant for, like, like a servant. Um, and then I have some booths set up for food. This one is, like, the Valentine's one for romance. Uh, and then these other two are just general, you know, food. The beaver burger. Um, plants on the wall. And then here is the dessert table. We have the... Uh, Starlight Donuts, the Valentin Fondue, um, these ones were the 
hatching tide cookies, I think. And then just a namesday cake. Um, a little bit of stuffed animals that I glitched onto the wall uh, just to make it like a cutesy corner for sweets. Uh, this is my junk monger in a vase. Uh, he has committed terrible crimes and he must be uh, contained. It's not even a real joke. I, it's not like I've shared the joke with anyone. It's just me being stupid. Um, this is my mender who is acting as a register. Uh, repair my stuff before I forget. Um, then there's like an actual Crystarium register and like the message book for people to leave comments. Um, over here is like the kitchen area, but we have like sweets on display, the little flower pots. Um, aprons on the wall, cheese and bread. Um, the various kitchens, the cutting board and the honey I put on top of it. Uh, the spice rack, the jars, the bottles. Um, this stew pot I put on top of there, the vegetables I put on there. Um, the various fruits and veggies as supplies. A couple NPCs in here to be cooking. Uh, this one's like the wine ate or ale tap. And then uh, this is just like a little makeshift dishwashing station. Various cutlery, some bread, etc. Um, I'll go upstairs first. Uh, this is just uh, where I have my music box. Um, the the aquarium's just up there just because. Um, and for the rest of this this area, I have these uh, lofts glitched up here, and I have them as like a little trophy center. Uh, I I managed to get all four of the uh, Delibrum Regine uh, soldiers set up, so that was neat. But then I just have the various others hanging around here. Uh, Blades of Innocence, a uh, little wedding cake that I just have out because the fruit bowl I just have out just because. And then this corner, um, this is a material vendor. This is like the wardrobe room, I guess I could call it. Uh, I have like the weaver station, uh, materials and the like, uh, mannequins, a little makeup table and whatnot. And then the fancier makeup table, the various medicines, cabinet. Um, I have my, um, what's it called? The crystal bell to summon Jandalin if I want to change my hair. Uh, and then this little area is the wardrobe for uh, changing because you want privacy, right? Um, and that's that for this room. But then over here, I have more like a bedroom area for myself. Uh, I have a couple of these other uh, toys on display. I have a I have a slowly growing collection of the newer stuffed animals. I have most of the older stuffed animals are in the basement. Uh, this is a little carbuncle corner because I like carbuncles, carbuncle lamps. Uh, just a little fat cat bank. Uh, this is my, uh, the unending journey for looking at cutscenes. I can sit in my little marble chair. Uh, the picture frame is a recent addition. I recently got the Castaway Chocobo Chick minion, and I was confused because at first it told me that I could use it on a fishing canvas. So I did that, it just gave me its footprints, and then that used up the minion, despite it having just walking on ink, which is silly, um, but whatever. Uh, over here I have, like, um, the book, the bookshelf, uh, is blocking the one other door entrance, so it's just, like, the one. This book's a little desk, um, my bed my uh, Allegan Tombstone of Frivolity, which is just my phone, my phone 
the little jellyfish lantern, which I wish was a lot easier to make in bulk. You need to use up a minion that you only get from uh, the submersible uh, free company things, which is not a reliable source uh, other than just burning through gill. If I could get more of those reliably, I'd fill my house with them. Um, but that's the ground floor and the top. Um, the basement I instead have as a jump puzzle, which is like, you know, for a restaurant, like a play area. Um, we'll just, this is where it starts, and you go through. Uh, I'll just step off the path. I have these stuffed animals, I have a fishing tank, teddy bear, I have a little uh, pond garden in the center. I have it like a little foresty theme. Uh, but we'll run through the jump puzzle really quick, just to show it off. Because I was originally debating whether to make a a nice jump puzzle, uh, or just have it be like a ballroom, because I wanted some kind of like entertainment for the restaurant. But I figured jump puzzle would be a little more interesting. I have this rainbow collection of um, curtains. Ooh. Yeah, I have the Mimic Go Go music on the playlist just because it's fun. Uh, and the rainbow leaves to Harshafon. Gay icon. Uh, my little gold saucer thing. I wanted to make this corner, like this little hallway, a little more complex than just these tables, but I couldn't think of anything at the time. I might come back and change it. There's there's probably a lot of things I could change. Uh, but over here is the finish line. Uh, I have the little starlight glitch thing. And then flower petals. And then here's all the gold. Uh, the crystal tower. Good. But yeah, it's like little your little treasure trove at the end for completing. And glitch through. But yeah, that's basically my house. Um, I don't really know what else to say. This was just going to be a quick video of showing it off. Uh, but I hope everyone uh, liked looking at it. Uh, I hope you'll check out my other videos of me playing various other games. Uh, I don't know if I'll, like, record any more, like, Final Fantasy XIV stuff. Uh, I don't really do, like, savage ratings or whatnot. I just stick to the simple, uh, content. And with this relic weapon done, I'm- I don't know what else to do. I'm kind of caught up on everything otherwise. And I don't feel like doing any other relic weapons. So I'll probably just like do dailies every now and again. Um, but yeah, that's enough of me rambling. I hope you enjoyed it. And uh, check out my other videos, if you please. Goodbye.